Friends, we are gathered together in the sight of God to witness and to bless the joining together of Caroline and Gentry in Christian marriage. The covenant of marriage was established by God who created us for each other. With his own presence and power, Jesus graced the wedding at Cana of Galilee and in his sacrificial love gave us the example for the love of husband and wife. Caroline and Gentry come to give themselves to one another in this holy covenant. Who gives this woman to be married to this man? Her mother and I. So Gentry, if you will first share these vows with Caroline. I Gentry, take you Caroline. I Gentry, take you Caroline. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until we are parted by death. Until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. And now, Caroline, these words to Gentry. I, Caroline, take you, Gentry. I, Caroline, take you, Gentry. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until we are parted by death. Until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. Now that Caroline and Gentry have given themselves to each other by solemn vows, with the joining of hands and the giving and receiving of rings, I announce to you that they are husband and wife in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Those whom God has joined together, let no one put asunder. Gentry, in celebration of your marriage, to Caroline, you may kiss the bride. <laughs> Magic.